Hi guys, happy Cricut Monday. What I thought we would do this week is just go over how to work with shapes, the score line, and images and put it together and make a really cute Easter card using um, images found in Design Space. So I already have Design Space pulled up here on my um, computer. So let me go ahead to new project right here where the circle and the plus is. And I already had something going so I need to replace that. Okay, so what we're going to do is first we're going to go over here to shapes on the left hand corner and click on shapes and I'm going to do a square because I want to make an Easter card. Okay, so what I'm going to do, um, this is, I've selected this, I'm going up here at the size where the lock is, I'm going to unlock it because I'm going to change the size, okay? And I want one that is 9.25 wide, and then I want it to be 6.75 in height. And then I'm going to lock that back, and there's our card, okay? And I'm going to go ahead and change this color. Um, I think I'm going to use this really pretty um, Eastery purple color, okay? Now we're going to go to our score line. So to get your score line, we go to Shapes, and here it says Score Line. You click on that, okay? And then all you have to do is just move it about where you think center is and just make sure that it's touching right there and then just pull on this blue circle with the white arrows till it's at the bottom touching right there okay and then what we're going to do is we're going to make sure it's in the center so we're going to select both of these and hit at the top a line and hit center okay so now it's in the center okay and I really went a little past where I needed to be, so I'll go ahead and scoot that in because we don't want that to show up on our... Okay, so there we have that. Okay, now all you have to do, this is really fun and simple, is just go over to Images here on the left-hand corner. And this is all of Cricut's images. And I'm going to go over here to, and you see images is highlighted right up here at the top. I'm going to go in the search bar and just put Easter. And then hit the little search bar. And you can see they have beautiful eggs. They have so many beautiful things to choose from. But I liked this one right here with the little bunny on it. So I'm going to click that. And you'll notice when you click it, it gets this green line around it. Then we're going to go right down here to the right-hand corner and hit Insert Images. Okay. And I want to put that right here because... I believe I could be wrong. I think this will be the front part of my card. And when you fold it, this will be the back part of your card, I think. Okay, so what I want to do to be able to um, print this on this is all you, all you have to do is just go and draw a, a square around it. And then if you'll see right down here at the bottom, See, this is all just cut, 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 cut. Right down here the side, this image here is set just to cut. Well, I want to print and cut it out, okay? So I drew my square around my image and my card, and then all I have to do is hit flatten, and now it's going to print it on the card, okay? I think that is so cute. Um, now, you can stop right there, or you could put uh, wording on this. It's, it's just really up to you, but I'm since all I was going to go over this week was just images and the score line, that's basically all I'm going to show you. Now, like I said, if you want to, um, and then what we're going to do is we're just going to draw a, 
get all this in there and hit group together, okay? And now that is one piece that moves together as a unit, okay? Okay, so now you can see this is all one piece and it moves together as a unit. And you will see over here, it's a cut and print now. So say I want to go ahead and make this. Okay, now you'll see my score line got off. So what I'm gonna do is move this right here and I'm gonna hit arrange, send to the front, okay? And then I'm going to go ahead and select it. Once again, hit align, center, and that puts it in the center. Now we need to group this all together so my score line will be in there and hit group. Okay, now my score line moves with everything else, okay? And you'll see here that now it is all a cut and print. So if you want to make this cute little card, all you have to do is just go to make it. And there you see it put it out on the mat. And then the first one is just going to print this out as an entire card. And then the second one is going to score. The second mat will score it. But this is such a simple little Easter card. And I wanted to just show everybody how that you could actually use images. I've made a card before, but I used patterns to do that. But this is just a simple little card for Easter using shapes and images from Design Space and then your scoring line. So I hope this video was useful and entertaining. So if you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Until next time, bye guys.